Hello, I'm Mr. Tan. Today we are doing primary three year end revision. So question one, what is the sum? Sum means plus. So we add them together. Nine thousand one hundred ninety one. Question two, what is one sixty two less than one three two four? Let's work out. Two borrow. It's one 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 thousand one hundred sixty two. Question three: What is the value of one seven eight and seven? So let's multiply. One thousand two hundred forty six. Question four: What is the remainder? So when seven and three divided by nine. So here is a. 7, 63 minus 73. So here will be 8, 72 minus 1. So remainder is 1 right here. Question 5. Name the line that is perpendicular to AB. So perpendicular form a right angle. So AB is this line. So that will be GF or FG. Question 6. Circle the flower in group of seven. Group of seven means one group is seven, seven, seven. Here is the answer. Question seven. What is the missing number? Two out of three equal to eight out of how many? So here, thumb four. So here also thumb four. That gives you 12. Question eight. Write 130 minutes in hour and minute. So one hour is 60 minutes. One hour is 60 minutes. So that will be 10 minutes. So it's two hour and 10 minutes. Question nine. How many right angles are there inside the figure? So let's count. One, two, three. Three right angle. Question 10. Shake one quarter of the figure. So first you can do four equal parts. So that's you shake two units. Question 11. Arrange the following fraction from the smallest to the greatest. So you can make them the same denominator. So 7 out of 8 remain. This is 4 out of 8 multiplied by 4. Here, here is 2 out of 8 multiplied by 2. So the smallest will be 2 out of 8, that's 1 quarter, followed by 4 out of 8, that's half, followed by 7 out of 8. Question 12. A toy car costs $37.50, neither want to buy a toy car. So the amount of money which is found in his wallet is so below. How much more money does he need to buy a toy car? So here is 10, 11, $12, $12 and 70 cents. So the toy car is $37.50. So let's subtract. So here is zero, borrow six, 15, eight, four, two. Answer $24.80. Question 13. What is the volume of the liquid in the container? So let's count. This is one liter, 500 ml, 300 ml. Here is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 60 ml. Add together, answer is one liter, 860 ml. Question 14. So the table is 40 cm, table B is one meter long. What is the total name of the two table? So 40 cm plus 100 cm, your one meter is 100. Answer is 140. Question 15. The figure below is make of straight identical rectangle. Find the parameter of the figure. So can you see that the length is actually make of the 3 cm plus 3 cm. So that will be 6 cm. 
So since you know this is 6 cm, this will be 6, 3, 2, 6. Okay, so now you add all together, there will be 6 plus 3 plus 6 plus 6 plus 3 plus 6 equal 30. And so it's 30 cm. Question 16. The bar graph below shows the number of cards each child had. So in box cover the bar so in the number of cards Joanne had. So Keith and Joanne had 53 cards all together. So the keyword here is Keith and Joanne had 53. So Keith is 28. Joanne don't know. So but you can take 53 minus 28. And you will find out that Joan had 25. Question 17. Edward walked 4,200 steps on the first day, 4,900 steps on the second day, and 5,600 steps on the third day, and 6,000 steps on the fourth day, and so on. So given that the pattern continues, how many steps did he walk? on the sixth day. So the pattern okay, let's write down like that. The day and the step. Yes, 4,200. Day one, two, three, four, five, six. 4,200, 4,900, 5,600, 7,300. So, so just add 700, 700, 700, 700, and another 700. So when you add 700, this is 7,000, and another 700, 7,700. Question 18. So Janet has 107 marking. She packs six marking. What's the smallest number she will need to pack? So 107 divided by 6, you will get 1, 6 minus 47. So here's 7, 42. So 5. So answer, okay, it's not 17, but you need to have one more box. So 17 plus 1, 18 box is required to pack all the markings. Question 19. So Louis has nine box, each by 246. How many token does Louis have? So you take 246 times nine, six times nine, 54. Nine times four, 36 plus one, 41. Nine times two, 18 plus four, 22. So answer is 2,214. Question 20. So you say that Sarah has twice of John. So John is one and two. How many crayons does Sarah have? So you have to take 102 divided by three. Oh, so sorry. So we one hundred and two times three. Your Sarah has more three times. Answer 306. Question 21. Kathy baked 188 cupcakes. So she had four cupcakes for tea. She then gave the remaining cupcake equally to each children. How many cupcakes did each child get? So first, uh, the model you can draw like this. Total 188. So you can take away four. And what happened is that here, the remainder is to put into eight equally. So how many does each child get? So first, what you need to do, you can take 188 minus 4, you get 184. After that, divide by 8. 
So each child will have 23. This child is 23 octet. Question 22. So Harry has some pot in his shop. So he bought another 4,293 on Saturday. Then he sold 2,148 pot on Sunday and was left with this. How many pot did he have at first? So just work backwards. Take 4,645 plus 2,148. Okay, so you get Six thousand seven hundred ninety-three. Then, okay, because he said that he bought, so it's like working backwards. So you minus away. And you get the answer, 2,500 pots. So he has 2,500 pots at first. Question 23. Bobby had 346 red button. Okay, we can underline that. So he had eight times as many blue button as red button. So let's underline eight times. So what it means that the blue has small red button, only one unit. So this is 346. So you have to find how many blue first. Simply take 346 times eight. That will be 2768. And here he said he used 20. So your model here, 2768, take away 20. Wow, how many are left? So 2768 minus 20, that will be 2748. Answer is 2748. Question 24. So Harley has two jugs of food punch. Jug A is 1830. Jug B is 1780. So how much food punch must Harley pour A into B so that you will have equal? So one way of doing it is okay, here is A 1830, B is 1780. So you see this extra part, just cut into half, I mean divide by two and give to B, then you'll be equal. So that will be 1830 minus 1780 equal to 50, then cut into half. So answer is 25 milliliter. Question 25. Tony, Walter, and Sean took part in a cycling competition. So the three of them started racing at 6 20 a.m. Then Tony completed the race in one hour. Walter completed the race 12 minutes earlier than him. Part A, what time did Walter complete the race? So let's underline 6 20 a.m. So Tom completed one hour. So but Tony completed in one hour. Completed the race in hour, one hour, that will be 7.20 a.m. Then for water, since water is 12 minutes early, earlier, so we minus 12, that will be 7.08 a.m. So answer is 7.08 a.m. Then part B, the total time Tony and Sean took to complete the race was one hour 30 minutes. So one hour 30 minutes minus the 60 minutes with the Tony, 70 minutes. So 70 minutes is Sean. So how long did Sean take? 70 minutes. Question 26. So Duncan has 10 tokens that add up to 440 points. 
So some of them are 50 point tokens, the rest are 20 point token. How many 50 point token does he have? So uh, you can do guess and check. So how it works is first, you need to have uh, the number of 50 point token and number of 20 point token. Then here will be the points from 15, 15 point token. Here will be the points from 20 point token. Then here will be the total point. So our goal is to get 440 point and 10 tokens. So let's start our first guess. So you can guess five, five. So five, 50 point will be five times 50, 250. Then here five times 20, it will be 100. Add together, only 350, so it's wrong. Our goal is to get 440. So you can do the next guess, maybe you guess here seven, here uh, three. So seven times 50, that will be 350. Three times 20, that is 60. Add together, only 410, so wrong. Next. So we guess one more, eight and two. So eight times 50, 400. Two times 20, 40. Add together, 440. Correct. So for part A, answer is eight fifteen point token. Part B, how many twenty point token must be exchanged with fifteen point token to get a total of five hundred points? So to get a total of five hundred point, uh, so the next guess that you will try will be ten. Here is zero, so 10 times 50 is 500. So here is zero, add together 500. So we need to change two. So for part B, two is the answer. With that, we come to the end of the lesson. Continue to practice on the e-learning website. That is www.studysingapore.com. So thank you and wish you a good day. Okay, goodbye.